Okay, guys, let's kind of sum up the vertical <clears throat> balance golf swing, the most easiest swing in golf, okay? <clears throat> let's start off with, uh, with saying what we're trying to do, guys, is to eliminate any lateral movement whatsoever, especially from our hips and our knees and our feet and all that stuff. We don't want it. We want to take most, if not all, of this lateral movement out of the golf motion. So it's vertical. In the rotary golf swing, uh, you're actually doing a lot of lateral movement, okay? A bunch. And the, the uh, rotary golf swing came along decades ago and uh, people kind of got away from the vertical golf swing. There's only one guy on, that I know of on a PGA Tour and he's not on it any, well he is, is Phil Mickelson. Phil Mickelson is an upper core, uh, vertical golfer. He, he's not a rotary golfer at all. Okay. So uh, all this rotary stuff started years ago and everybody went to it because they thought that they were going to improve, which some of them did. I'm not saying, you know, if you're a rotary golfer, that's fine. But for us older guys, a, uh, a more uh, of a vertical swing is a lot better on us and our bodies. We don't tear our bodies up. And even though that, you know, probably years ago, we tried it ourselves. I know I did. And I hurt my back, and hurt my shoulders, hurt this, hurt that. <clears throat> so uh, that's what the vertical balance swing is all about. Now, let's, let's uh, and it's real simple. I'm just going to sum it up in this video. The grip, I take my, my grip, I take my thumb on my lead hand, and I'll have it, well, I can't get it. Just, just off to the right of the top of the top of the grip. And then I come on with my other other uh, hand, and uh, I make sure that my right arm, my right hand isn't under it. The grip is pretty neutral. If probably probably uh, uh, goes to the side of a little bit weak, but it's pretty pretty well neutral. Okay. Uh, you want to be able to feel your arms, the, this bone right here, you want to be able to feel them while you're gripping the club. You got this arm turned this way and, and all that stuff, you know, for a stronger grip, it just doesn't hardly work well. <clears throat> the next thing we want to do, let's talk about ball position. Ball position, you got to figure that out for yourself. Mine is right in the middle of me, okay? Right in the middle uh, for, for all my irons depending on what kind of shot I want to hit and all that stuff. My driver and uh, three wood is a little, is probably a ball, ball and a half in front of my, the, the middle of me, okay? That's where I play them. You, you may be different, doesn't matter. Now, in the vertical balance swing, what we want to do is, like I said, you want to keep the bottom half of your body, your hips and your knees pretty well silent. They are, they are going to move, but they're not going to be moved on purpose. They'll move on their, on their own when you do the vertical balance swing, okay? And so in in uh, in reviewing this, you want to set up a little bit. You want to be able to stand up a little taller. You don't want to be slouched over like this. Stand up a little taller, and when you take the club back, it's, it's taken back with a turning of the upper torso like this and that puts the club on your toe line so you'll turn and that's the first move now i'll, I'll turn about like i said i'll turn until i see my shoulder get on the ball and it's probably 35 degrees or so maybe 40 okay and then i'll stop now at that point what i'll do when i get to this We'll just call it position one. We'll just go to this position with a toe up, not like this, but toe up. And all I do is just lift my arms, okay? And you wanna make sure that this right elbow is in the center of you or pointing down to the ground. And it will be when, if you do this and just lift your arms, it'll be there every time, every time. It's just repeatable time and time and time again. And that's what golf's all about. You gotta be able to repeat that stuff. Now, in transition, coming down, after I get to this position and I see outside of my, my eye, 
my peripheral vision, okay, I can see my shoulder on the ball. I do not want to see that shoulder turn this way, rotary. I don't want to see it doing this. I want to see it going up and back. And when I do that, it's all over with. That one little bit, bitty move, then I can let my arms come as fast as they want to, okay? And that's all there is to the swing. Now, <clears throat> once you start doing this, you'll find, you'll, you'll find out that you'll quit finishing like this, and it'll probably be more like this, okay? Now, that's as simple as I can make it. You guys go out and you do it. This hat, you know, I got my, my rogue driver. Well, Gator Golf, Walter, up in Wisconsin sent this to me. And Walter, I want to I thank you for that. And I will be wearing this hat in each and every one of my vids from now on. So Walter, appreciate it, buddy. I'll uh, be glad when uh, y'all get out of the snow and er everything up there and get out where you can play some golf. Talk to you guys later. Hope that helped. And uh, just go have fun. Bye.